Hi everyone, this is attorney Ayhan Akbin and today I'm in front of you to share one of the latest news we have and as of this week we can clearly say public charge rule is gone and especially the way that Trump administration actually created this rule basically changed it and shaped it in 2019 which was you know the originally the public charge rule has been in existence since 1999 but in 2019 Trump administration actually changed the rule in a way to deny people to get a green card or to get a status in the US so as of this week this rule is gone the Biden administration actually announced that they're not going to continue with opposing this rule to be actually in effect again and because of that last year court decision uh, became final and now a public charge rule is gone we can say in a way that 2019 uh, described the rule it's gone now starting March 9 of this week all the green card application are not required to file I-944 form including the documents the supporting documents it's not needed anymore but of course based on the 1999 rule people still have to provide financial sufficiency to make sure that they will not go become a hurdle on the government that continues uh, but other than that public charge rule is gone so now starting all this uh, this week all the green card applications or any other change of status applications people don't have to actually provide this information and documents anymore and uh, USCIS is not going to consider all the applications that filed starting last year March 2020 when people are going to get their green card or decision on their case those public charge rule and documents are not going to be considered anymore if people in the meantime got on a few requests from USCIS telling them to provide I-944 form and also all the supporting documents so they don't have to do anymore so they may still have to respond uh, saying that they're not required to respond it or make sure that if the IFP ask for additional things that's not part of the public charge rule they still have to reply to that but but starting March 9 of this week there's no longer I-944 form needed and no longer people have to provide public charge information and documents with the applications to USCIS or with the State Department you know regarding the uh, visas at the consulate so this is a great news and I wanted to share with you this last minute uh, news and I hope that helps and we'll talk again have a great day